morning welcome to this week's vlog it's saturday today um i've already been up and at it uh we i got up early today because Aldi was having one of those special buys and I wanted to get myself one of those like sit stand desks because I thought they'd come in handy so I um, grabbed one which was great um, and yeah that was about it so now now we're just going to have some breakfast my mum's making breakfast for the family so they're coming over and we're going to have some breakfast and that's about it for now so I'll, I'll probably tape that when they all come and I'll show you guys so here is oops let me turn that the table that i bought and i'll show you guys once we put it together hey chip Olovki. hey chip how are you going sweetheart good boy <laughs> you're so cute and breakfast oh and the gang is back hey dean hi Bubba get a new jar from Nutella. Yeah. There you go. And Nathan. Chibi. <laughs> hey guys, it's Sunday today. I'm not sure where I finished off yesterday. Actually, what did we do? We bought the table. My brother and sister came over for breakfast. Then, what did we do? I think we, we did our supermarket shopping. Yes, we did. We did our supermarket shopping. And... Then we just hung out and I think I didn't tape. Did we hang out? I can't, you know what? I can't even remember. It was only yesterday. But I feel like we weren't home. But I think we spent a lot of time in the supermarket. But also um, I went to Kmart but didn't really find anything. So yeah, that was our day yesterday. Um, I'll show you guys the table. I had to rearrange my room so my chair is now back there. Um, and I'll show you guys the table. So this is the table, sorry it's a bit backlit, but um, yeah, that's what it looks like for now. It's nice and big. I just need to find something to put the cords in and stuff, but this is going to be great for when I'm doing like cooking with stanzies or even if I have to, like it's a sit and stand desk, so I can put it down and actually use it as a desk, which is great. And so today we are heading on over to my, can you see Chippy? <laughs> you can hear me talking so he's thinking what's going on. Uh, we're going to head on over to my sister's. Uh, Angus's brother is going over so we're gonna have a bit of a visit catch up a little bit it's been a while and that's about it all that I know we kind of it's a long weekend this weekend so we also have tomorrow as a public holiday as well I'm not sure what our plans are for tomorrow um, but we'll see what happens so I'll try and bring you guys along for the ride <laughs> but apart from that, my mind is usually so blank in the mornings like I've done my makeup done my hair I washed my hair and blow dried it um but yeah then it's like a bit of a blank so I'll see you guys later well so I put a little bit of greenery behind there just before I'm leaving for the day um yeah I thought that looks a little bit better so it's just not like white against white and you can't see my like dodgy paint job so yeah oh we have a mirror here i don't even know if anyone's seen this bit of my house but hello there's a nice mirror there and there's me and a little bit of junk and there's the table again all right now we go morning guys it is sunday today i know i was pretty bad at taping it today. um we did go over to my sister's house angus's brother did come over and his wife and you know we had a lovely like lunch and chit chat so i didn't tape it's a little bit intrusive when you're taping when people are like you know just enjoying themselves um so yeah so and then after that we literally didn't really do anything we just watched a bit of tv and chatted and that was about it just relaxed so today is monday um it's a public holiday here in new south wales uh we actually don't have plans i think with all this you know covid stuff that's been going on we've been used to like staying home which is good you know like we're not really ready to be at full force out and doing stuff if we don't really need to but i'll let you guys know if we do do anything and yeah that's about it for now my mind as usual my mind's blank in the mornings but i've just put on a little bit of makeup and that's about it chip is sleeping on his little bean bag and i've just got a video that i'm going to edit this morning before we head on over to my sisters and then decide what we're going to do for the day so just saying hello good morning guys it's monday today free it's actually tuesday because <laughs> yesterday was monday it was public holiday so it always gets confusing but it is tuesday today so yeah yesterday i don't even think i recorded we what do we do I know we went for a walk, a really nice long walk over at a, a big park near the city and 
that was about it and then we just hung about and yeah so right now Chippy and I are heading on over we're gonna go for a walk by the beach I hope it's not too windy because it's a really nice day and then I'm gonna start my day after that so see you guys soon hey guys just giving you an update on today I've actually haven't sat down yet I've been doing so much cleaning oh I haven't even had lunch yet. I think it's like after two anyways um yeah I've been like kind of deep cleaning stuff uh, some of the plants that I had outside, I want to bring some of them in. They're like plastic ones. So I've like been washing them down so I can bring them in. I did my washing. Like I washed a couple of loads and I've hung them out. And they're not really ready. I don't get that much sunshine in, in the back where I hang them. So sometimes I have to hang them out for like two days. But anyway, that's fine. And what else have i been doing i feel like i've just been cleaning away I haven't even noticed I haven't really taped anything i just deep cleaned my kitchen um, mat i'll just show you guys it's just out there i'm not going out because we're having people working next door doing some construction so a little bit noisy but i'm just letting it dry out there my clothes are there and yeah my sister lent me she had bought two of these little like basket things so I'm gonna put my cords in one of those so then they look a little bit neater. And I gave Chippy like a little mat here for just his food. I've got to clean that up before I put the mat back because that goes there. And yeah. And yeah, so the time is totally gone and I just feel like I haven't achieved that much. But my back is a little bit sore from all the bending I've been doing and cleaning and stuff. And yeah, I'm probably, I don't even know. I um, might have, I feel like it's a bit late for lunch, so I might have like a lunch dinner a bit later. And that's about it. Um, I feel nice, I guess um, I restarted going back on my walk with Chippy, like longer walk down by the beach. And, I, and yesterday we did a nice long walk as well, so I feel like it's giving me more motivation to do stuff, which is really good because during this whole COVID time, I have not been feeling so great. I've been spending a lot of time just like watching TV and YouTube and all of that so I'm glad to get back into being a little bit healthier uh, I did put a new battery in my scale and weighed myself and I'm back at the weight I was like last year before I went on my holiday so I now have to like start my journey again but it doesn't bother me like we know how it works you know um, it's all a matter of I want to have a healthy mind and you know a healthy body so slowly slowly we'll start that again and yeah, so that's it. Probably for today. I'm not sure if I do anything exciting. I'll show you guys. And I moved Chippy's beanbag over here, and here he is, little boy. Hey, Chip. He still sleeps in it, so I can't get rid of it. It's so cute. Hey, Chip. Hey, guys. It is Wednesday today. Yes, it is. That public holiday really got me, so the days are confusing a little bit. Okay, yes, it is Wednesday today. Um, this morning I dropped off my nephew at school and then I went to the shops because it is like raining outside and I thought it's not like I'm going to go for a walk with Chippy, so I'm not, we're not going today. So I went and picked up a few things that I needed and I thought I might as well show you guys. This my pyjamas drying here, by the way, if you're wondering what that was. Um, some of the clothes that I want to dry sooner, I bring them in and sort of pop them around the house everywhere and then hope that they dry from like the warmth inside. Anyways, I went over to, I went over to Chemist Warehouse and Priceline. Let me show you guys. I got two things from Priceline because they were having a sale on like the NYX and I got my um, NYX lingerie, the, my bedtime flirt, I'm pretty sure, yeah, bedtime flirt it's called. Uh, this one, it's a lip, like a lacquer. Um, the one I had ran out and I really, really liked this color. It's like a nice neutral but more on like a brown tone neutral so i really liked that and because it was on sale so i went and grabbed myself one because i've been waiting for it to go on sale i don't like to pay full price for things so i grabbed one of those but also um what i've been noticing a lot with my mascaras are that um i'm getting like a lot of fallout underneath but also like squishing into my under the eye area and so i grabbed myself a waterproof so i got it in this essence brand which is really quite inexpensive so i grabbed a waterproof one this is the i love extreme it's a volume one looks like this like these are like seven bucks at price line so i thought it's something not too expensive to have but to try waterproof because i generally don't buy waterproof mascaras 
I don't even know why I don't. I just don't. I buy the regular. And I want to try waterproof to see if that's going to help with having like any fallout. So I'm really excited to try that. I'll, I'll let you guys know. Like anything that I buy uh, and you got, and I don't maybe not mention in my vlogs like how they're working and stuff. Feel free to watch my empties videos and then I let you know if I liked it, how it worked for me. If you're interested in stuff like that. I uh, also grabbed my most favorite. Um, I'm a lost for words what it was called mouthwash <laughs> yeah my favorite mouthwash is my favorite one um it ran out and uh, i've been going a few days without any so i really needed to grab one and oh that's from chemist warehouse so the next one is from chemist warehouse um what i actually went to chemist warehouse was um i'm nearly out of my rose hip oil and i'm loving it like i feel like it's doing a lot for my skin so I'm nearly out of the Trilogy one and I was going to go pick one up but then this Sukin brand one was having a 40% or half price sale like I think it was about half price so I thought I would try it because I looked the ingredients are exactly the same which is like rosehip oil like certified organic rosehip oil and I have um, tried things quite a few skincare products in this brand which I liked I was just trying to see if it's Australian I'm not sure it's i don't know maybe not maybe it's uk um doesn't really say but anyways never bottled in australia okay anyways yeah so let me just have a look at what the bottle looks like so it looks like that it's a pretty big bottle. it's 50 mils which is good so i'm hoping this will last me a little bit longer i think my trilogy one might be 30 it's a little bit smaller than this that's why it's, i've probably gone through it but um, I'm happy to let you guys know if this works exactly the same. I don't see why it wouldn't. It was half the price. It was only like $14.95 or something like that. So um, I think it was well worth it. Um, I also, I've ran out of um, my hyaluronic acid. Uh, that was probably like a month ago. But I've been using, so I was, so I was using the copper peptide. That I ran out of that. And so I just bought another from The Ordinary, another hyaluronic acid acid this is a 2% plus b5 i think that's the one that they have looks like that i mean i always i always cleanse my face and then i use this first and i just love it like i think i don't know i think it does well i've been noticing my skin's gotten a lot better so i'm thinking everything i'm doing seems to be working okay also um i needed some more of the chafing cream chafing 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 um cream and i haven't tried this brand before it's the zo rub one looks like that got it from chemist warehouse um and i just wanted to try this element i usually use the neat one and that one works really well so um i thought i will give a different one a go and see how it works it's not very big it is 75 grams but i'm hoping it will definitely do the job so i'm really interested in buying um a one that looks like a deodorant stick that like you can without getting my hands dirty because sometimes like it's it's a bit of a hassle to have to put it put it on and then have to go like you know rewash my hands and stuff so it's qu nice and quick to have like a general one like for for example portable purposes like you can keep it in your bag and then if you need it like at the beach or somewhere like that like you can pull it out and use it so anyways i'll i'll look into that I'll probably grab one a bit further down the track and lastly another issue that i've had i probably never mentioned to anyone um is i have a lot of skin tags on my body uh just genetic my dad has heaps and of late they've been annoying to me my like bra gets caught um caught on them and then they're a little bit painful and stuff so i got this to try it's a skin tag remover i know probably the best thing is to go to the doctor and get them frozen off or burnt off or whatever they do because i did talk to my mom and she said my dad did go to the doctor to get them removed so that's probably my next step but i've already bought this so i'm gonna give it a go if it works i'm happy to do this and then don't have to go to the doctor but otherwise i'll probably go because it's come to a point where yeah like i don't like having them i mean they don't do anything they're just there um, I don't know if you guys have any. That I, don't, I, ha I do have quite a few, like on my back, of my stomach area, and they're quite a nuisance. So yeah, I'm gonna give this a go and see. And if you if you want uh, me to let you know how it goes, comment down below. Let me know. I'm happy to get back to you, and let you know if it worked. And that's all I got, which was quite a bit anyway. But yeah, so um, I did some filming today, and I'm not sure. I think I'm going to edit the rest of the day and spend some time with Chippy, and that's about it. So 
I will catch you guys either later or tomorrow. Hey guys, it's Thursday today. So I've just popped on a little bit of makeup because I wanted to try the, the mascara that I got yesterday from Essence. The wand is like huge, but it went on really nicely. So now I'm going to test it out for today to see if, because I put on my bottom lashes too, which was a bit of a challenge because the wand was so big. But I want to see if it's going to cause those like panda eyes. So we'll see how we go. And I also, um, I put on my two lip colors. So on the bottom I have on the NYX one that I bought yesterday. Like it's a repurchase. It's a bedtime flirt. And on the top I have the new one that I got from Flower Beauty. Which is, I think it was called Bear Honey. They are the exact same color. So now I know like whichever one is on sale. Like once I run out. Which will be a while now because I have two of the same color. They are pretty much, you can probably see. Pretty much very identical color. Which I like because I feel like it's my kind of nude. So great about that and it's a very comfortable formula which i like like it stays on my lips really nicely it's not drying the maybelline um that 24 hour one that one's really really good but very very drying on my lips this is really comfortable and i like like it's a nice matte comfortable both of them because like you know i have the two but yeah so today not oh i've got a bit of a turn here um not much is happening what am I doing? I had a bit of a slow start to the morning, I must say. Um, I dropped off my nephew at school and it was a little bit cloudy, so I got under like my blanket and watched a bit of um, YouTube. And uh, now I'm going to make some lunch and I'm going to head on over to my hairdresser a little bit later because it's time to do the regrowth, as you can see. And that's about all I have planned for today, for now, that I can think of. Um, yeah, so I just want to jump on and say hello and give you guys a little quick update. Okay, so I'll catch you guys later. Hi guys, I'm just jumping on because I didn't record yesterday and I don't think I showed you guys my hair, but it's done, it looks fresh, I love it. And I'm just jumping on to say goodbye and thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.